Hello, welcome to lesson seven. In this video, I will explain how to pronounce initials D and T. So, these two initials has a similar place for pronunciation. You first put the tip of your tongue close to your top gum and push the airflow pass through your throat and your mouth. So let's repeat. The so the way it pronounced very similar to dog, the the in the second one, t the pronounce is similar to tom, t t the t as we have learned. Four finals already. So let's see how we could combine the and t with these four finals of vowels. So according to the pinyin rule, we could put the and a together, pronounced as da. We could put the and a together, pronounced as the. And we could put the. And e together, the pronounce is d. However, we cannot combine d and o together. In the Chinese language, there is no way you could pronounce these two together. So remember, o cannot combine with d. And this rule also work for t. So means both d and t could combine with a. A, E, but not O. Okay, let's try the first combination, the and a. So as we have learned previously, da. This is a light tone. Then we go for the first tone, da. Second, da. Third, da. Fourth, da. Here I pick the pronunciation of da for you. It's this one. It means big. So when you want to say something is big, you say da. For example, we learned ma in a previous video. So you can combine these two together. Means da ma. So big horse. So how are you going to write it? It has three strokes and simple. Hopefully, you can learn the writing from this video. So the first stroke is a horizontal stretch. Then the second stroke, third stroke. So this is da big. You can put this in front of everything you want to say is big. And the second thing we want to learn is the combination of t and a. So the first tone is ta, 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 ta. And here I'm going to introduce you an important pronoun for the third person. Ta. For Chinese language, it's the same like English. We use different format for this. For example, for the man, we say ta. It's written like this. For the woman, ladies, or girls, we use a sign of girl. If you still remember how the ma is written, on the left side we have a sign of female, ta. And the third one is for the little ones. Is use another sign like this. So ta for man. Ta with a female sign is for ladies. And the third one is for animals, or very little ones. This one I will explain the combination of the and a. Here I present a light tone the. And first and second, the the, but not third and fourth because there's no common characters for that pronunciation. 
And the last one is a combination of te and a first tone, te. Again, there's no common character for te, te, te. So I put only te to let you know this is the only common pronunciation for this combination. Here I'm going to introduce important character, the is light. Here is this one, the. So the is usually puts after adjective or pronoun for modified noun. So it's it's kind of connection word like of in English. So here if you combine ta and the together, the meaning is his. So if you want to say his mother, you say ta de mama. All right. So this is for men. And the pronunciation for all of them are the same. The only difference is the handwriting with different character to show it's male, female, a little one. Here you see, ta de mama. Okay, this is for today. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.